Hey everybody, welcome to our real estate news to use. My name is Lindsay Hyatt and I've been an agent with Weikert Realtors for going on five years. And my name is Jason Shu, and I work for Guaranteed Rate Affinity and I've been lending for almost 24 years now. So let's talk about buyer do's and don'ts when it comes down to making a home purchase. First, you're gonna to wanna to narrow down your search criteria with your agent. So how many bedrooms and bathrooms? Do you want a lot of square footage? Would you like a yard, a basement, things such as that? You also wanna know your loan options. Are you gonna be putting down 3%, 5%, uh, no money down? Are you looking in an area that is a possible USDA option? So those are very important um, to figure out. Next, you wanna make sure that you are working with a skilled realtor. So someone that has your best interests at heart, that knows the neighborhood that you wish to purchase your home in, and that also has good negotiation skills. You also wanna check your credit score. Now, this is something that can be done for free. Uh, you can use online sources such as Credit Karma, PreCreditReport.com, um, Equifax, TransUnion, and Experian all offer a free one-time credit report per year. So definitely knowing your credit scores can assist you in the process. Next up, we have buyer don'ts. So you definitely don't want to change jobs going into a home purchase. That could definitely impact your approval. If you're planning on changing jobs, you definitely want to notify your lender and so that way they can look into the details of the change to make sure it's not going to impact your approval. And avoid any major purchases. So don't go out and buy a car, a boat, new furniture for the house that you are excited about. This can all affect your buying power. It's important not to miss any payments on any credit cards, car loans, if you own a home currently, uh, leading up to within 12 months of your home purchase. Lenders are gonna look back over the last 12 months and that's gonna weight heavily on your credit rating. So try not to miss any payments. It's okay to be a few days late, but you definitely don't wanna go past 30 days as it'll impact your credit rating. And lastly, don't apply for any credit cards. This is going to put a ding on your credit report, which isn't going to go over very well with your loan officer. Thank you for watching our video. We would love the opportunity to get to work with you. Please feel free to reach out with any questions.